What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today we're doing a cool deck with ZMAC featuring two different types of dinosaurs with Dino Roar. Uh, so the deck, we're going to be really building it like a Stompadon, but it's very cool that we have Tankalosaurus also, which will do two damage every single time you draw a card. And the very cool card we're comboing with these is Unexpected Gifts. This draws three cards, so it's going to be activating your Dino Roars uh, for three. Just think of a three-cost card that makes every single minion in your hand have plus three, plus three. Uh, if you have the Tankalosaurus in the field, then that's going to do like two random damage three times around the field. Uh, just from that. We're also running Middle Manager, which can draw a card, and Going Viral can draw a card, and the Quasard can draw a card. So this is going to be a sort of a mix. We'll see if this kind of idea works between a Flag Swarm deck and then a sort of a late game Stomp It On uh, value deck. So you have two different ways of playing this. Uh, one is you actually have three ways of playing this. The simplest one is just a flag swarm. You can play flag zombie. If you happen to have a flag zombie and a middle manager and a con man in your hand, middle manager will very often give you a one cost professional. Uh, just throw them all on the board and you are going to be able to get so much value on turn two. Again, you don't play on turn one. Just flag with all your one drops on turn two and that will give you a very wide board. Then you can win by following up with going viral and with your quasars and your superpowers and your uh, fruitcakes in order to remove whatever they play. Your superpowers are also very good uh, at, you know, buffing both in strength and health uh, your wide board that you've done with your all your little guys that you've flag swarmed, and then the Missile Madness and Electro Ball, very good removal cards. Very good superpowers uh, in z kit. The second way of playing is to develop your flag zombie on turn two. You know, this might trade with Berry Blast, but if it's not a Kabloom Hero, not a whole lot of um uh, zombies have a way of dealing three damage on turn two certainly there's not a whole lot of two cost three twos that people run in the game it's just like corn dog and i don't know uh flaming p not very common cards so you should be able to develop your two if it trades then great uh if not you'll actually be able to get one of your dinosaurs on turn three turn three would be very cool to stomp it on and then that will cost three and then immediately play your zero cost middle manager uh, if your flag zombie does survive. You can also just play this deck slowly and just pull, develop your con man on turn one. Maybe play another one drop plus rolling stoning their triceratops or their twin sunflower, whatever they play on turn two. Playing that tempo game, you got Quasar, which makes a great turn three play, uh, and then build up into one of your dinosaurs and sort of play slowly uh, and controlling your opponent and developing a field slowly and then you'll be able to really burst with the unexpected gifts and you're going virals in order to give you a lot of value after your dinosaurs are already established. Let's see how this deck does. Hope you guys enjoy. And we are going to get right into the games. Games should go pretty fast. This is a deck that really takes a long time to, to win. So we should have time for 10 games today. If you think this deck will win 7 out of 10, vote yes. 6 out of 10 is going to be a no over here at the live stream twitch.tv forward slash prime up this should be a lot of fun we'll see if it does well too that's the real question guys who has the most overpowered set of superpowers Zmax up there i think huge giganticus overall is probably the best all of his superpowers are just really really overpowered <laughs> one cost environments and his hg super if you start with it you basically auto win so this is interesting we can try to slow play this we have two dinosaurs now. I'm gonna try to slow play this hand. Maybe we'll get like a lightning bolt, unfortunate. But we'll just try to set up the um, the dinosaurs and then maybe like turn four Tankalosaurus, turn five Stomp it on with the guy. We'll see how fast the Spit Owl tries to play. Unfortunately, we don't have an answer to that. Let's see if we can get a Rolling Stone here. Just to stall a little bit. There it is. There it is. This is fine. So if we develop something even stronger, we'll Rolling Stone that. If not, he thinks we're going for Weed Spray. I don't run that crap. Uh, the problem with this Pear Cub is it really severely messes up this Tankosaurus. <laughs> Do I even play this? I have to. I have to get the Stomp it on later. I mean, if I play Stomp it right now, it just gets Berry Blasted, bat blasted plus any one drop just kills this. Um, he might have a Galactic Cactus to set up to explode. This is... This is not an interaction we like. Not at all. Uh, so we are gonna go stomp it on Middle Manager to be able to at least get one buff on two minions, usually. 
Maybe we'll tap tech a, another minion here. It would be really nice. A fruitcake would also be nice. Wow, so I think we actually have a flag zombie play here. Oh, fortunately, we didn't hit that. Is there a reason to play flag here, though? Like, we could flag stomp it on middle manager, but then the flag doesn't get the buff. I think it's just stomp it on middle manager. A little weird. We'll take that immediate buff here. Uh, go face. Please go face. Yes. Good, good tankless source. So far, he's behaving perfectly. Thank you. So now he's going for the 2 4. Let's see if he has a one cost, like, team up nut he can put here. Yeah, he has that. All right. So that's okay. We got value out of the Stompin' on. It absorbed his superpower, and he had to, you know, spend four. He spent his whole turn doing it, and we still have these buffs in our hand. Uh, so we're gonna hold that, because it's just free two damage anyway. Oh my gosh, the Tankless Horse has been godlike. Absolutely godlike. Look at the, uh, pet synergy now. Oh, what do we do? So we can go 2-1 and then just, just absolutely demolish, and that's what we're doing here. So it's gonna be 2 to the 1. This is another superpower here. We have just unlimited cards. That's okay. I'm just gonna like unexpected gifts are going viral and hey, honestly a five damage right now. We have 16 health. We'll be all right. We can probably lightning bolt it next turn. I kind of just want unexpected gifts right now. <laughs> is going viral even good? It adds three damage. Oh my god. Okay, so it's Rolling Stone definitely here. We have cannot have that. <laughs> no. Bad. And then telepathy goes a really long way because there's two shots. I didn't realize how good telepathy was, obviously. Come on, just double shoot shoot this, that's fine. And then we lightning bolts and we're good to go here. Look at the insane value. Amazing. I'm probably just gonna stomp it on gifts now. Thank you, Axo the Victim. Welcome to the Frymily. Subscribing with those free Twitch Prime subs. Helping me support my family while I do this. Thank you so much. So it's going to be you. This is just free. <laughs> Stop. I was kicking it. And this grows. Oh my gosh. Look at our hand. This is just like a zero cost 4-3 right now. And it's going to get way bigger. Way bigger. I think it's just gifts. I think gifts just wins. No one cares. If we going viral, so we'll get three and three. Nah, it's gifts. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Let's see what we get. Three minions, please. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, <laughs> it's kind of GG. Sort of. Sort of. Good game, man. Uh, let's just end with this. We're gonna probably spend all of our all of our brains next turn on this going viral. So that's fine. Uh, another Dynamo Roar! So we might as well play like the Strike Through minion here. Um, I really want to play going viral. I might even want to play... I shouldn't have played a Gravestone, whoops. I might even want to play like the... Yeah, let's just play this. Well, I should not have played a Gravestone there, though, right? So it's going viral and fruitcake right now. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, pretty sure we kill him just with how he shamrocketed that. <laughs> like, yeah. Did we win here? I think going viral just straight up wins. We had six damage, make it seven. Hell yeah. Brother. And here's a fruitcake for you. Merry Christmas again. Enjoy some fruitcake. You're dead. <laughs> Well, I mean, the deck literally in that game did everything it was supposed to. That way, we didn't even get that good of a starting hand. That Tanklosaurus was godlike, though. Godlike. Yes. Hell yeah. Brother. Brother. Yes. Whee! Tank definitely putting in the work. You kidding me, man? The unexpected gifts was amazing there. 
We had a monster at hand. I like how when you play the gifts, I, I just realized a little synergy between like flag zombie unexpected gifts gives you almost all minions. You know, there's fruitcake, which is an event card, and unexpected gifts, I guess, and going viral. There's not a lot of tricks that come out of that, and you can really like if your flag zombie survives like that game. That guy didn't want to miss. He didn't want any of this. Good thing I played a gravestone, I know, right? I thought he was just gonna grave bust then. It, it's nice having a deck like this that doesn't naturally run any gravestones. It makes all this stupid blockbuster annoyingness. So this is interesting. I think I'll ditch one Quasar. Um, I, I'm, I'm just wondering if we're gonna need going viral if we have to face this guy straight up. I'm not seeing going viral on this kind of board. There's two of them. We're probably just gonna try to slow play this. Really depends what he does. If he plays like a... I, I'm always like paranoid they're gonna play Haunted Pumpkin on turn one and we just don't have an answer, but I don't know, man. People are really not running a lot of Haunted Pumpkin these days. Even like Solar Flare, you know? So we surpered that. Do I start playing cards here? I think I am. I'm gonna go for this and a single Rolling Stone. Interesting. Ouch. Oh, it is Aggro Solar Flare and he just didn't have a one. Holy crap. Yeah, the last game didn't count. So now what do we do? Uh, I feel like I'm gonna want a fruitcake, but I don't really have a play. I think I'm just gonna go for this and... Maybe something will work out. Wait, what happened? Was there just lag? There was just some lag. So we did that. It's an okay, Rockwell. We're taking so much heat. I'd love to be able to block the second shot. We're all at three here, we'll see. I'm just gonna develop this. Shut up and take my money. Would Rockwall be better if it gave undrinkable? I think Rockwall's actually a pretty decent superpower. I don't think it needs to really do that. So he's he could actually win right here. Let's see if we block. Oh my gosh, you're all the one? Gosh. Dear God. Okay, well, we have three health. We are a berry blast away from death. Oh my, he could actually kill this too, because it went faith. Can we can we kill the 5-1 here? He has berry blasts. Who am I kidding? I need a gladiator there. Gladiator was our only out. He definitely has berry blasts. Let's be real, guys. We'll save for these, just in case he plays a bunch of cards. No berry blast? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We can answer almost any other play he makes here for turn six. Strike through minions. Oh, okay. Okay. And then little dudes. We're gonna z super here. The question is, how far do we go? Like, I think it's going viral and this survives. We don't really care about this wing nut at all. And we'll save the fruitcake for later. And 2-3-2 two, two actually kills this now. In fact, do I even need to Lightning Bolt? Maybe I just Rolling Stone here, which is more useful. The Lightning Bolt's better next turn. The 3-2 the playing around Scorch maybe is good. I think this is funny. The Lightning Bolt's really good. Wow, he does not have a Berry Blast yet. Yet being the operative word. Let's see what... Oh, we didn't get the... Oops. <laughs> There's gifts! I'm just gonna... Cool... Just thinking, this will do two... Three, four, five, six... 
Conman might be good if we're trying to just win this turn. Yeah. I'm gonna try to push for lethal in lanes 1 and 2. It's just a matter of time till Solar Flare gets Berry Blast, so let's try to win this game here. I think we win. I think, ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Because it's gonna be 2 damage from this. It's 3, 4, 5. Oh, wait, he's doing 3 here. Hold on. No, 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 I'm messing something up. 3, 4, 5. I have to not lose here. Okay, quick, 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 quick. quick. I'm just going face, 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 face. With this. Was Fruitcake the, the play there? Okay. And we got it. Well, you can see there's a block. Scorch would not have done anything. Weed Whack would not have done anything. Actually, no, he would have. He could have blocked there and just won. I don't know. <laughs> it worked. He didn't like it. He couldn't deal with the gifts. He's like, no, it's not fair. It's no fair. Um, I realized that we could have supered lane one because his weed would have died in the lane. There was just too many things happening that turn. I was too busy trying to actually make guaranteed lethal in the first two lanes. Was there a guaranteed lethal, though? Yeah, so the play was Fruitcake lane 1, Super lane 2. And then we would have... It's... It would have been... Well, no, no, then it would have been lethal because we got two more damage from Conman. I think we just needed seven. We had three on the board. And then it would have been two more because of the fruitcake, and then two more in between turns. We did have guaranteed lethal there, and just eluded me. Okay, we can try this into the Tanklosaurus. It's kind of cool. Maybe we'll get, like, a lightning bolt on turn one to just deal with this Galacta or whatever he plays. Yeah, oh, yes. That's what I want to see. Should I spam this on one anyway, just to pull player and forget me notes? Kind of. Sort of. If it, if he plays Click B, does this really need to come out on two? I think this is always just good on one. Primal Potato Mine? Who cares? There also is the option now of just going Con Man Lightning Bolt, which maybe is better. Just to play around Triceratops? I think I might go for it. These flags are cool, but tank on three is cool. I think being able to kill a try, uh, bruh, you're annoying. Should I lightning ball this? Uh, it's gonna be two and one next turn. We'll probably get a better lightning bolt, sorry. Even lightning bolting this to reset things. He could also play Captain Cucumber here and the lightning bolt limits it to one to guard. Bruh. <laughs> Rumble now? Drew a card, so we do a face. Alright, is this the lightning bolt now? Pretty sure that's a little scarier. We actually have a free flag zombie right now. Might as well play, right? I think flag in one, tank in two looks pretty good. Should I spam this? It's just spam. I'm gonna save some board space. Doesn't really have a lot of ways to deal with a 2 6 here. <laughs> He's setting up the pair cup against the Tankalosaurus. Come on, man. Alright, Tankalosaurus, you know what to do. Honestly, even if it hits it between turns here, it's fine. I'm gonna unexpected gifts this turn and have a pretty decent chance of killing that. Let's see what else is in the box. Would like to see a Stompin' on a Quasar to going viral? None of the above. 
Should I set this up just to block the 5 damage in case it doesn't hit? Why not? Oh, he used the superpower already, so he can't have Rumble. True. Very true indeed. Can we hit the same target twice? I don't care what it is. Another gif. <laughs> you know what? This dies. It's okay. We actually hit each target once. <laughs> or something. Yeah. Here's going viral, which is cool. This actually makes the going viral active. Because this flag zombie's free, and now we have three left. That's ridiculous. This could just win. This this guy does eight, so he'll be doing like nine. Uh, he has four. It's not enough. Bruh. Dude. Like, dude. Ow. <laughs> Ow. Onion rings, OP. Going viral does six damage to his face here, man. It's pretty damn good. I'd also like an extra chance to draw into a dinosaur to use with this gift next turn. It's we're actually doing even more. It's six, seven, eight. Where he's gonna have four health here. Kinda ridic. It doesn't save the Unfortunately. Oh, it did save this. Oh, I forgot it brought this to seven health and it has armor so this lives and kills him next turn. Great. Fantastic. We'll save that for sure. Oh. <laughs> My head is somewhere else today. We're doing pretty good here. There's Dickweed. So it's gonna be... Uh, fruitcake is like really good here. So let's try to draw out of our deck. I guess this can draw free cake too. What's more likely to get free cake? <laughs> I don't know. I think we got him though. This does not die to the, the going viral anymore. Yeah, we got this guy, bros. This man, dang it. What can he get? He got use time to shine. There's Rumble. It doesn't do a damn thing. It does seven. Does Rumble even kill this? No. <laughs> not even close. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Of all the things Grass Knuckles has, um, his superpowers are also decent, uh, especially with the time to shine. doesn't really have a way of like preventing lethal with them. It's usually like, if you have it on the board, then blocking doesn't matter at all. Alright, well, we're 3-0 with this deck so far. So good! It's amazing the Tankless Earth and the Stompadon have been taking over the games. Like, been getting a lot of value. Just the amount of resources it's been taking from opponents to get them off the board has really given us an advantage. Now, this is a very cool hand with Conman and then also, you know, not Quasar. They have the, the Middle Manager and the, and the Conman. We have Removal. This hand kind of has everything. It has card draw in it. Secret Stealthy card draw. I'm gonna go with this on one, I guess. Is this more rumbleable? I'll play some. We have a lot of very not rumbleable cards in this deck. This deck really, there's only two minions with two health here. Cool. Yes! Gifts caring, exactly. Gifts too good. Here's a middle manager. Should we turn these into two ones here? I think I'm just gonna do this with Lightning Bolt and we'll set up the second one next turn. We have, you know, just these middle managers have a way of really setting up a board really efficiently without a lot of cards in hand where you can hold on to that fruit cake and that going viral. Um, it's nice. We even have the answer to Juggernaut here. It's this, this Lightning Bolt. It's such a good tempo card, man. This we're not gonna Lightning Bolt though. This we're just gonna let happen. We save. Yeah, we get the damage in for free, why not? We don't need a one health middle manager. Right now. We'll see what's in the box. So two cards and a lightning bolt looks awfully good here. We'll see. Wow, the teacher! I'm developing the teacher, screw it. We can still lightning bolt. If the teacher lives here, we are in insanely good shape. Have we seen the superpower yet from him? Yeah, he's Holoflora, so he can't even have Rumble. I don't have to play around that. 
I'm playing around the spike weed sector, why not? Yeah, this deck is kicking some kicking some stuff. Ooh, ooh. Uh, Lightning Bolt's really good here still because it kills not only this huge card that would have been a 4-2, it also kills the Lily. So that's awesome. Bye, Lily. That's fine, that was good enough. That teacher, man, coming in clutch as per usual. So this is an interesting decision. We can go for going viral on two cards. It's not that good. I'm just going to play this. It's never going to hit an environment. So I'll just do this in either Fruitcake or Rolling Stone. There's a bunch of cards that would like to get Fruitcake or Rolling Stone here. Everything from B-Rex to, I don't know, Starch Lord. <laughs> Uh, so this is going to be a 3-3. Three, three. I think we might as well just fruitcake there, right? It's pretty good. It keeps also this damage, bullseye damage roll in here. We're doing a lot of damage already. At least trade, it's okay. Middle manager. Conjure teacher. I mean, it just already got as much value as it needs to get from half of a one drop. Come on, man. So now we got going viral and fruitcake. Going viral is so clutch here. Not only does it turn these into bigger threats, but it draws us a card, so we're not going to run out of steam in this hand. <laughs> what is he doing? Uh, so we could Rolling Stone, but I think this is just better. It's just so much more damage. In fact, this is usually lethal. We usually hit, hit face for lethal here. What the hell is this? He got this from Fruitcake, right? There's another one. Fruitcake, completely fair and balanced card. Yeah, we just need this four not to get blocked, and we are home free. Yes! Yes! Four and no. oh! Dynamax dominating. Stompy Lasaurus. Let's go! Yes! I'm so happy with the way this deck is sort of like the balance of having early game, having ways of winning without flag zombie is really important for every flag zombie deck. And then it's not too much unexpected gifts. It just seems like everything's falling into place, man. The middle manager, man. <laughs> middle manager is a card we overlooked for so many years. It's so much value for a one. Look at this hand, man. I think I'm just holding on to this. Should I even keep the con man? Con man on one, double min middle manager on two, quasar at super on three. Sounds good to me. Sounds like a plan. We'll put the Quasar here since it's probably the worst card on this board. Maybe one of the middle managers. We'll see. So happy I don't have to play around Triceratops right now. What a luxury. Let's see what's in the box. Let's see what's in the box. L box. Um, the middle managers will be better since we're gonna have two of them and then also two professionals. Each middle manager becomes exponentially better when you have another one because not only is there another professional to buff its attack, but that professional you have two extra professionals and then this one buffs that one, man. The inter synergy is real. Uh, that's cool that he used him big in here just to keep a 4-2 alive because we have a really good answer to a 4-2. It's called a 2-2. Two -two. Let's see if we can get something that blasts a 2-2 two -two here. That is not it. So we'll either rock wall or... Bruh. That was not rock wall. Wow, I really wish we had an answer to this card, man. Look at the P deck going. Um, is it worth it to rock wall here? Can you Rika too? I'm just trying to figure out what I'm gonna do next turn. I think like going viral. I mean, we're not gonna be able to go viral and fruit cake though. I'm gonna blindly do this. He buffs this card. It's okay. Uh, he only does have three cards in hand, so he's already used a couple of small peas. Well, he's probably not gonna spam. I mean, he could have two peas here. But then this dies. It's okay. There's the Rolling Stone. Needed that. A week ago, could go. I'm just gonna put the three two here, and then we still have a fruit cake to deal with whatever big threat he plays. Uh, and if he doesn't, then we'll fruit cake. You know, can fruit cake here? We can rolling stone this directly. There's a lot of things we can do. 
That is annoying, but we are going to be able to answer that, right? Oh, we actually got off really, really easy in this turn here. Uh, so Eureka first, because why not? This middle manager doesn't even die, by the way. And we get the Rolling Stone. We'll love to see it. He only played 1P. That's the whole game right there. He's not going to come back from this. I hope he doesn't get, like, I guess Freeze, Super, Blow would be the best case scenario here. Could you get Blow, please? He already using Big N. Yes, Blow, Lane 1. Come on. Yes! <laughs> what? Okay, this is one of the streams. Sometimes I have where everything goes wrong. This is the stream where everything goes right. What the heck just happened, bros? So now what? We can set up Stompadon. We can put four... I, I kind of just like the Stompadon. There's three and two just to stabilize the board a little bit. I think we go for value. I don't know. He could have, like, some... Do we even chump lock here? For board space, I guess so. It also buffs this to 5, which is doing a lot. There's the most useless card in the game. But even if the Stompadon dies here, you know, he could play like Gatling and 4. Even if the Stompadon dies here, though, <laughs> I have this guy pretty mapped out. Everything except for the Podfather, I guess. Um, you know, we block this now. Uh, nah. We still have a really good buffed board here. Now what? Unfortunately, the curve sucks because we conjured every card we conjured cost four. This was Eureka, by the way, and middle manager. Yeah, that hand kind of sucks. But this becomes a five-five. No, it's still not enough though. I have to deal with this, right? So we should probably use a 4-drop to deal with it. This actually wins the trade. Alright, we still have free kick. That's a decent play. We could free kick aggressively. We can also, again, if he removes the 4-5. I don't even think I'll free kick the 4-3. That loses a trade next turn. So just fruit cake this. It gives him a card, but we can't really deal with taking all this damage right now. I think we're okay in this game, even giving him another card. We have a really good hand. We just need the the brains to deal with it. I'd love to go in viral as soon as possible here. We still just don't have the hand for it. I mean, I could go 4 one, 3 I'm, I think we're just going to wait another turn before we're going viral, right? So we just go 4. It wins that trade. And then just 3. Well, going viral next turn, I guess. We're, we have 12 full blocks. He's not going to make a great trade in lanes 2 or 4. We do have great trades in 1 and 3. We should be okay here. Bro, okay. So he procs a block. No, he doesn't. He does, it's, just, it's just a 1 for 1. It's okay. Hello. And that's another one for a half. It's okay. The card advantage continues. And we still have this 4 6 monster on the board over here. He's got a 4 3. Who cares? I might have put the peanut behind to proc the block. I guess the 4 3 is probably better than a 2 4 double strike. I guess so. If he doesn't have any buffs. So, now what? I'd like to go in viral, so 4, 1, and 3 looks awfully good. In fact, let's just go face. Screw this. Screw it. We'll develop flame 5. It's going viral, it's looking awfully good. He thinks that's gonna do something. Little does he know, this whole thing dies for free right now. <laughs> Such a good going viral. So it makes a trade. We're blocking anyway. If we get like lightning, we rock wall strength. So it's like ZMX super and lightning ball. I might as well do this to go face, right? Yeah, why not? We could go. We could go. Proc the block and we got lethal in two lanes. We got this one, guys. He has freeze or I don't know, super. Neither of them do a damn. Not a damn. Not a damn thing. Yes!
Yes! Woo! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Bam, bam, bam. Go! We're 5 and 0. Oh. The happy day at the office today. At the happy. Hi, <laughs> friend. Details to follow. I'll announce that soon. Okay, sorry, I need to space in here. Here's Guardian. I, we're just gonna slow play this anyway. Uh, and go hold this. To be tempted not to Rolling Stone the Galactic Cactus on turn one. Let's see if he has a trade here. So. Depending on what we draw here, I think we'll maybe go more for turn three. Just pass. Yes. Well, we're going for ten games today. So, this should be fine. So we got two. Doesn't really matter the lanes. Just want this to be in lane four so things get hurt. So this gets more attack. There's another one. The Quasar and the Superpower are not playable here. I'm not really sure what I'm playing around. Raptors? Some kind of Guardian play with Triceratops? You probably, yeah, he could against Zemek. Theoretically, have a Triceratops not played on turn two. I think we can play patiently here. There's no need to rush. Uh, a going viral would be really nice because we have this really wide board. That's okay. That just trades with a superpower and turns into a 2 2. It's still, we have card advantage. Like, he has five. We have six. Which is better. Um, let's see if the Quasard of all things, can make this hand have just more tempo. We have cards. We just need some power right now. Giving this strength ain't bad. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna do this, just in case he does a double removal play again or something like that. And we got Rolling Stone, Rolling Stone, Rolling Stone. The fact we ran three Rolling Stones, last minute decision this deck, just trying to think about how are we going to control until we set up our sort of late game? Um, the Rolling Stones have been exceptionally clutch. So him with that. And, uh, I don't know, I guess Gifts. Maybe we'll encrypt the Quasar here. So this will actually kill, but there's so many things that, that I think we have to just fruitcake, right? What's gifts? Anything that has an upgrade? <laughs> They're so cheap. Just fruit kick this? Yeah. Well, encrypt the quasar next to If he just blocks and gets bubble or his. or rain or his ultimate. <laughs> Meteor he already used, so every single card there saves the star, so we really don't want that rolling and drawing all of his cards, and we'd rather him draw one from Fruitcake. Kill his engine. There, there's going viral. Okay, now we have a, this little board with all these little one and two attack cards, all of a sudden becomes something. He's also not blocking this turn, so we can deal with this much better. What's going viral? I think I'm just keeping the Quasar on the board for now, because it represents three damage to face. And we will have board space, which is really nice. So I'm gonna strength lane four, so this dies. Um, this will explode, which we want. We want the board space right now. And it's as simple as that. We, we could encrypt. We want to develop another card. And he's not blocking, so third Starch Lord bites the dust. Wait, it's all Starch Lord? All Star Slurred and removal? A seven! That's ridiculous, guys. This is a one cost card. It should not be able to do seven. 
Holy moly with that. So now what? I mean, we could delve the 2 4. This is nice because he has to kill everything else. This shit will actually get value here. I think the I think the Freddy Cat's the best. We didn't really have you know decent cards, but they're not proactive let's win right now cards, you know? This just means if he starts using tricks to remove anything else on the board, the you know, the cat all of a sudden becomes another card he's gonna need to remove. Ah, <laughs> we're six and zero. Oh. Let's let's be real, guys. Let's let's face the facts. He ain't surviving this turn. Oh, here he goes. Yeah, I know. But now he has a three three. Uh, we it's a squirrel. It doesn't move. Let's go, squirrel. You can do it, squirrel. Wow, is he actually going for it? I changed the score already. It's too late, bro. They see me rolling. Uh, okay. Trolling. And again, he, his last two superpowers now are just like huge bubble. So it's just rain. And uh, it's just rain. Yeah, it's just rain. We cat wins. Get him, cat. Sick him. My attack cat. Yeah. <laughs> and we killed three Starch Lords. This is like the greatest day of my life. Three Starch Lords down the drain. He conjured no roots that game. Zero. Yes. Get outplayed. Blue Genius? That is such a good name. Oh, it's so good. Props, I should concede just because of the name. No, I want to play this guy, never mind. Gotta get a going in here. Um, okay, we can't keep two dinosaurs. This is cool. Should I keep it going viral? I think I'm just gonna look for, like... Okay, this is very interesting. I know this is better with the Stompadon, but... It's really turn three Stomp, too, man. Alright, let's just keep all these little minions. Do I develop Con Man on one just to develop, you know, absorb some of his resources here? It will be. A, I think I do against Beta. Yeah, you know, let's just do it. The problem is if he plays Galacta on one, all of a sudden our flag zombie doesn't survive as often next turn. So maybe then I don't. Do you not Galacta? Thank you. It's getting started. It's getting started. We got four games left, including this one. Again, this is pretty good. I, there's not a whole lot of corn dogs in the meta right now. So we should have the turn three stomp it on here. He could play like his, his superpower plus a one drop. There's not a lot of things that deal three. Could you not have your Lieutenant Caratron, please? That's fine. The other really good thing in this matchup is that the only card that he really deals with stomp it on well is um shrinking violet and the stompadon's gonna have a dino roar like i don't think he's gonna deal again he could have spike weed sector plus this turn i really don't think the stompadon's gonna even die here and then we can protect it next turn with rock wall this is pretty damn good will this be the we have the stompadon game already but i'm ready for another one this is the turn three stomp it on game remember stomp it on just used to be a three class two four same stats same ability same everything is he not even going after this right now uh we have to play around shrinking violet i probably should have thought of that a little more last turn but i'm not gonna play these with just the one buff so Shut up and take my money. interesting so can we get a fit check what does that mean? Air slides. How, is a check of how fit I am? Is that what that means? I'm a boomer. You have to translate this stuff, guys. I learned all my meme culture from you guys on the stream. It's actually not true at all. I watch memes on YouTube all the time. Wow, look at this. Look at this amazing top deck. Holy moly with that. That's insane. That's insanity. Insanity. 
So we either Rolling Stone or Rockwall here. I don't think there's a need to force these. I think keeping the stomping on rolling. No! Third forget-me-nuts. Wow. The good news is we can Rolling Stone this next turn, and he only has one card. He's probably not even going to be able to grow this. And we win this trade? Hell yeah. Uh, never mind. I'll just take this right here. We save the Rolling Stone. We can hit the Lima so he doesn't get stonks now. I think he pogged me. Three names. What is your favorite? Osama Bin Laden, Bullet 1963, or Matt Head? <laughs> Osama Bin Laden by about a mile. By about three leagues. So this is cool. We're gonna hit him with the with the untrickable. We'll hit him with the cheese. Hit him with the cheese again, and then we have our choice of superpowers. Love it. And got a rolling stone this card before uh, anything happens. One plus five does kill this, but we got the rock wall. We'll be fine. We really don't want it. again in in drawing a long string of magic beanstalks is basically his only path back into this game. Dragon is still a couple of turns, right? Yeah, still have two turns. We'll, we'll kill him by then. That's cool. So we gifts next turn. And Rockwall. Rockwall here is, looks awesome. Tanklosaurus is gonna keep this board nice and clear for us. Bro! So this does not even do anything. So we just save the Rockwell. That's a cool top deck from him. We got that from Foda. But what are his superpowers, man? He could conjure something, he could conjure tricks, or he could play Lieutenant Caratron. He's probably just gonna play it here next turn. I don't know. That's right. So Quasar is really good. This will just die to the gift soon. Or the Quasar. He's down to five. We good, guys. You got three cards. Soul Patch? A Soul Patch would kind of stink right now. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> That's not a Soul Patch. Let's get it started. Let's, this is actually going to feed his dinosaur. It feels bad. But it's so much value. In fact, I'm going to Acid Rain first. And then we'll do this, so there's more chance of hitting face slash his minions. Wee! <laughs> Wait! What was that game mechanic? It shot one time, then his die, then he drew a card, and then the second two happened. What? 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 That's the order of unexpected gifts, guys. First. You first, first you draw one card, then he draws one card, then you draw two. You like take turns drawing cards. I bet you guys a hundred bucks you didn't know that. You guys didn't know that game mechanics. That's guaranteed lethal, by the way. That was wild. I mean, I guess it makes sense if there's a card that draws you cards for both of you. That, you know, you you play the card, you're also a zombie, so zombie goes first, so zombie goes one, then plant goes one. I, if you notice, it's just the Triceratops grew in between shots one and then two and three. It grew in the middle, which could save it, theoretically. If there's a Dino Roar, it could save the cards from dying from a Tanklosaurus. It actually makes a huge difference. That's so cool. So cool. <laughs> You learn new things every day, man. <laughs> I saw two damage come out. I'm like, what? Why is it only do two? Where's my other four damage? I didn't go face. The guy would have one health. <laughs> that was hilarious. That was hilarious. I think that's the game mechanic, though, man. That's a highlight right there. Of all the things that's happened today, the highlight comp is the goofy ass, <laughs> unexpected gifts game mechanic, man.
That was amazing. It's just from left to right? It's just from left to right? What? Give me a second, guys. I'm going back after this one. Okay, I'm watching the back. Okay, so we played Acid Rain, then we drew three cards. Our Tankalosaurus went, then his Dino Roar went. No, it's not left to right. Because our Tankalosaurus shot first, then his Dino Roar happened, and then our Tankalosaurus, that same one, shot two more times. Left to right is not the explanation, guys. That was truly really unexpected. <laughs> unexpected gifts lifting up to its name. Yes, yeah, we're going for that Tenno Dream, guys. Let's not jinx it. Am I planning on joining the Peepsy Heroes tournament? I'm planning probably on um, hosting it and actually doing some live commentary on the finals. So that will probably be my participation, which I think will give it that proper tournament esports feel. Uh, details to follow. That is the plan. Yeah, massive tournament coming up. I should put a link here in the chat Man, for it. That highlight sure was an unexpected gift. Credit it sure was. Dream on starts playing. <laughs> dream on, dream on. Um. Uh, you guys want a link to the tournament? I'm gonna do the first announcement right now. Now I don't know when this video. This video will end up on YouTube no matter what. We can drop three games here. It's gonna go on YouTube. Um, so if you guys are watching this, I am putting it in the chat right now. I guess you'll be able to hear the copy from the chat, or if I remember, I'll put it in the description of this video. Here's Nightcap. I, I kind of like this. I think we're just going to go for it. I mean, maybe we should play around. Yeah, I'm going to play slow in case it's Cycle Cap. We're going to play this, plus we can still have an environment on turn 3, which will make him hesitate, hopefully. All right, here are the rules. Posting the rules in the chat. Oh, that's a big, big... Well, you'll have to copy it. And here is the sign-up link. Going in the chat. One after the other. You can see them right there. Pause your video and start typing. I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can remember. Someone in the comments if you see this on YouTube. Um, this is actually an aggro deck, which is... Maybe better than, than Cycle Cap. We don't have any environments in this time. Completely neglected that. Dream on. But yeah, they have some room for some more signups. I'll probably make a YouTube post about it. It's one of the trillion things I'm supposed to do. It's a very blast. It's okay. The check means outfit. Check you, silly boomer fry. Oh, outfit. Oh, thanks. Air slides. That does make more sense. What's my outfit? <laughs> I'm wearing a t-shirt and a pair of nice comfy cotton shorts. Nothing to see here, guys. Nothing to see. Black t-shirt, black cotton shorts. The cotton shorts have a gray stripe on them. Isn't that awesome? Uh, I'm gonna sp sp spam stomping on number one now. He already used a berry blast. Which makes this more likely to live here. Okay. Besides for shrinking violet, this doesn't really do four damage a lot on turn four. Can stomp it on live here, it'll make a huge difference too, because then we get double stomp it on value next turn and it's gonna be ridiculous. Oh, it's cycle cap, nice. God damn it. Okay. Okay, that's fine. He's drawing two cards here though. Get wrecked. No! Bad. Very bad. Basically, extremely evil. Let's just draw two cards. Well, this is how we do it. This is how we do it. 3-3 three, three, Zookeeper. More where that came from. Hey, look, we have Pet Synergy. I love it. When is the tournament? Everything is in those links I just sent. Starting like next week, I think. Okay, you guys wanna see my outfit? Here's my outfit. Fit chat, guys. Look, it's beautiful. Isn't it lovely? 
Do you guys, are you guys, are you guys overwhelmed by my dad's sense of style, of, of fashion? This is called dad fashion, okay? You wear a comfy t-shirt and you wear comfy shorts and you don't give a damn. That's, that's what you do, guys. That's how we do it in Ohio. <laughs> the hell? It's Cycle Cap with Punish Room. I don't even know what else. He's actually could kill the stomp on here. That would be sad. Could you not one in like it's says one in two my stomp on. Please go face. Please go face. God damn it. What am I supposed to do? Luckily we have another stomp now. Should I even stomp it on? Or should I tank it? I think we stomp it on, right? Dream on! Dream on! Wow, you got that song stuck in my head. Thanks, Samish. Rawr! More dinosaurs! Dinosaurs are awesome! Uh, cool thing is we usually block this turn and... We'll, e we'll definitely get some sort of lightning bolt, so... That's gonna be awesome. <laughs> Do you have to add strength? Yep, I, it's precisely, uh, exactly the amount of strength I have. Is dad strength, dad quantity of strength. <laughs> Infinite risk. What is this guy's deal? He got from cosmic. He answers everything I play. He play answers literally everything. I don't have an answer to that. At least we blocked, right? Oh, oh, I forgot. I never. Oh, this came from Quasar. Oh, I thought we already had Rockwall. Whoops, <laughs> I didn't even look. We have three superpowers left. Oh my gosh, he just drew a card from that? That's so annoying. Okay, well... At least our uh, Stompin' on lifts. That's what we wanted, right? The problem is, we're just gonna die. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. Maybe we'll get, like, Chop from this. Or Heal. Heal would be amazing, actually. Okay, well, we got another rock wall. <laughs> Welcome to the prime bully. Oh no, 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 man! <laughs> this guy doesn't miss. He does that's just like our tank Lasaurus from the beginning of the stream. He don't miss. He don't miss. Yeah, we got like a non-anything, a completely useless superpower from Quasar. Guys, look at this shit. Look at this crap here. <laughs> This is just a wall and it's made of turds. Look at it. Look, it has like a nice yellow turd stuck to the bottom right of it. You see that? That crap? Oh, no, 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 no. Here comes the site. Okay, well, here comes this now. I think we lose no matter what anyway. Uh, uh. <laughs> Let me just read that. Oh, we so dead. We so dead. GG. That's the one we're gonna lose. We will lose to Cycle Cap. Maybe I should just run environments, guys. Honestly, if we were able to deal with that, uh... <laughs> with that Planet of the Grapes... <laughs> I don't think I can really, uh, realistically take anything out of this deck for Planet. I mean, maybe I can. Honestly, even Gladiator would have been good. Gladiator answer, answer Cycle Cap. That's just a shame. Remember that time I got three rock walls and I killed a ton of no? Remember that? This game will go down in history. Actually, that wasn't such a bad card. Oh. Sing with us, sing for the year, sing for the... We're gonna play some tempo here. You guys know how it is. That is okay. Uh, this mini ninja might end up being a threat that he can't deal with. It could go face if we rolling stone the whatever crap he puts in front of it right now. Uh, the other scenario is we just rock wall it and it ends up being an engine for our middle manager to grow every turn. We usually just rolling stone lane one. Oh, come on. Be a be an actual be an actual Chad. Don't do that. Okay. Be honest. <laughs> la la la. Thanks, Galacta. Always a pleasure doing business with you. Always a business doing pleasure with you. So we're gonna play this now. I don't know how the stomp it on and the tank Lasaurus are gonna factor in here, but this middle manager is gonna have like a lot of attack here. 
Sing, we know, sing. So I guess we're rolling some four, yeah. I'm so happy this wasn't a Triceratops. That would be a three five right now. Objectively overpowered card. Yeah, middle manager goes face for like zero because he's gonna block, but otherwise it has like five attack. Watch him just rumble here. It's really not bad if he rumbles. Because it's just more resources down the drain and Stompanon's gonna come in. He's saving it for next turn, maybe? He fought a really long time about it. Stompanon first. He could play P Rex in three, but then he takes like <laughs> he takes ten damage his turn. It's not a good idea. I love how we have the Rolling Stone this turn to protect this potentially. Well, you do sweaty OTK cactus. The deck I'm thinking about doing. Oh, that's not what we want to see. The deck I was thinking about doing is OTK. Like poison ivy. Sorry, not poison ivy. Venus flytrap. And the more you grow it, the more you heal. And use umbrella leaves to protect it. There's something there, man. Wow, he killed my stomping on? You bitch. I could keep the stomping on rolling, but I think I'd rather just rolling stone. This stomping on's hitting one minion. The cool news is, is that the flag still lifts. We also get a little damage before this lifts. He ends up with no board. I end up with a flag and a tank with goddamn Tanklosaurus. He could just play like Gatling here. He probably have. Wow, 3-1. This looks awesome. Put this in the rumble lane. And this not in the rumble lane. Give me a good superpower. Huh? Could be worse. Could be worse. Would this be insane to try to to super brains it on over to lane four to save this card? I think it's worth it, right? I mean, we're taking six then. Is that his last chance of winning? No, this is our last chance of winning. Screw it. We're actually taking eight because he's always blocking here. This is fine. He just holds that no matter what. There's no card he spends here. It would be protect. You definitely hold that. You don't play rock wall here. Well, root wall, whatever. Uh, okay, well, there goes half our health. <laughs> I think that was our last hope, though. Let's get unexpected gifts for the win here. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Wow, how greedy do I get here? I mean, I, I'm going fa- I mean, oh, okay. What would it take? You grow this and plant food. Okay, I guess I'll play around that crap. But if he grows this, we lose anyway. I believe- I believe in the power of Tankalosaurus. And your mom. So, Tank could just go face here for two and we win. <laughs> Just trying to be optimistic here, guys. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Feel punished. Can we kill something here? No. There's five. Six. <laughs> Come on, go face. Come on, Tank Lasaurus. Come on. Oh, we have another shot. Okay, that one missed. Ah, uh, here. Another shot. Another shot. Shot, shot, shot. Yeah, that one's dead. <laughs> that guy. That guy died. Uh huh. <laughs> Does this go in one to try to win? I mean, plant food or anything like that automatically wins. So I think we try to win. We're only gonna have one shot at his face. If we don't do this. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe we'll proc the block and then win in lane one with a four three. Oh, that's bad. Alright, the only win condition right now, the only chance, Tanklosaurus has to hit a 1 in 6, and then we have to roll another 1 in 3. Come on, come on, come on, YOLO! YOLO! Oh? Oh, oh no. <laughs> Alright, Galacta did us in. Galacta did us dirty. 
Come on, man. We're seven and two now. How did that happen? Oh, I forgot to award the channel points, guys. The, ch the answer was yes a long time ago. Okay, guys. Go ahead. I got to get the eight and two today. This deck. Eight and two. See, we jinxed it. We totally jinxed it. Remember when I said even if we lose the next three games, it's still going on YouTube? Oh, it's happening. It is happening. It is. <laughs> Here's beta. We shouldn't have any problem here. That's a perfect starting hand, too. We're going to do some old school proper flag swarm. No messing, no plates on turn one. None of this crap. We have going viral, so setting up gladiator is just fine. So here's flag. Middle. Oh. I didn't even think of doing stoke. Never mind. I'm going for stompadon. I didn't even see the stompadon there. We gotta do this, right? He's not killing a 1 3. He ain't doing crap. <laughs> yes, easy. <laughs> the most easy day of my life. So the question is can we get another middle manager from this middle manager? What lanes do we do here? You can put a team up. You can also like get a superpower that does two damage. I think it's gonna be harder for him to do four here, so let's just hit him with this. Are we playing this gladiator yet? I think we are, so we can do going virals and stuff next turn. Rawr! Here comes a two four. Lovely. Uh middle manager also grows here. Bruh. That was his whole play though, so Stompin' on keeps on keeps on hitting it. Uh you think he has a shrinking violet? I think he does. <laughs> it's another Stompin' on. Oh, we got gifts? It's like gifts. Is that better than going viral? We'll see. They're shrinking. Fry, what's your favorite color? Uh you're just what your mom, whatever color she is. <laughs> what do I do here? I have blue. I have blue. I like blue. Blue's my favorite color. I feel like Stompadon and then this. And then, well, it's turn four, so turn five. We can't do that, can we? All right, let's just kill. Well, this does one, one, one. I'll just going viral. You know what? We'll get a middle manager or something. There you go. Fruit cake. Love. <laughs> Sorry. You know, off the rails. It's like six now. And then two. Oh, that sucks. Now we'll have four and two next turn. We'll just blast this thing. That's one of the cards he drew. It's okay. I mean, maybe we still say, maybe we'll just go 4 and 2 next turn. I feel stupid because it's just wins next turn, this whole thing. Let's just go 4 and 2. It should be good enough. It's a 4 6. He's either going to have a Sham Rocket or he won't. Oh, wow. Now we get this. It's probably still better. It's still Lightning here. Don't Sham Rocket my life, bro. Lame. Wow, we we killed this whole lane though. So. And you're dead. We end up with nothing from all the stompadons, because this man had every removal card known to mankind. That was fun. Can you not have another shrinking here, please? Oh my gosh! Squirrel! I love Squirrel. That kills that for free, that's okay. Never mind, it never does it, it never does anything. What a dick! This will go up to 4-3, so let's just do this part. Quasar, lovely. 
Lovely, lovely quasar. Guacamole. Guacamole. It's turn eight. I really hope he doesn't have a dragon. That would be annoying. This guy would officially be the most annoying guy in the history of guys. I have to kill this goddamn Virginia. No! What? I can't deal. Okay, well, it looks like we lost three games in a row. Looks like that's how this 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 happened. I can't deal with this. We can fruit cake it this turn and hope for the best. Hope he doesn't get another dragon. He did not get this from Free Cake for the record. So we have Fruit Cake and either Lightning Bolt or Eureka. We're actually still in this game. What the hell? Should I Eureka because we need that way more than him not healing for two here? <laughs> I don't know what is happening here. <laughs> this game just reset. It's turn 10. I don't even know what's happening. 7, 10. Looks good to me. This is just going on heights, I guess. I'd love to be able to pull a gifts off here. I think it's just gifts, right? Yup. I don't care. I don't care. There's no way to make this live, so... It's just YOLO gifts. You only live once. This goes up to six? No. Uh, to five. Look at the dino roar. Look at the game mechanic again. I draw one, he draw one. It's fair. Completely fair. That's a really cool 5-5. Five five. That's awesome. <laughs> We're not running out of cards. He's also not Starch Lord. It's Starch Lord against unexpected gifts. Oh gosh. This is so annoying. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do here? Five five one doesn't look very good. How about five? Three, eight, nine, no, wait, eight, nine, ten, eleven? I think I feel like doing more things this turn. I mean, he's gonna go face for so much though, because he could just play one trick. That's probably a mistake. But he could also grave bus, and I don't know. Probably one trick is fine. <laughs> well, he killed that. Dude, okay, well, he just has answers to literally every card I play. That's how this game went. I literally had a chance to win here, but I guess not. Aww. Eleven. Two. What am I gonna do? Six and nine equals fifteen. It's not enough. Well, what if he, like, he puts something here? Well, then the frenzy doesn't happen. What if he puts team ups here? Then six, six, and six will work. Alright, guys, we got one more chance. It's this guy playing a team up in lane two. Let's see if he does it. <laughs> then we win. <laughs> Can you please do that? <laughs> okay, every card I played today, every card, every card I played. Every card, every card. There's nothing in our deck that solves a 13 11 untrickable, so. That wasn't even fun. We have to play one more game, guys. There, we finally killed Starch Lord. Worth it. Worth it. We got Sizzle from his. Light speed ugly superpower. Okay, we're playing one more because we actually dropped all the but guys. We need to get one more win. We're gonna go for the eight and three here today. Bonus round. Oh my gosh, I hope this is another cycle cap. <laughs> he answered every he had the sham rockets, he had sizzle for a five attack card. Come on, I've gotta deal with that crap. I'm gonna deal with that crap. I'm gonna deal with that crap. 
That was crazy. I believe I can fly. I believe I can I really hope this isn't Cycle Cap. He passed turn one, so it probably is. Think about it every night and day. I'm gonna maybe play Quasar and try to get a superpower. How does that sound, guys? It's our only choice anyway. Yeah, very blessed. And fly away. Be like and soul. Come on, environment, please. God damn it. Yay, he knows we don't have anything, so. Can I get Gladiator would be the one card that would save us right now. Running four in our deck, this deck should actually be fine. But no. But no, it's not. He had the perfect hand against us. I don't know what that means, Stoko. Like Counter Tron with Beta? We did that already. Call it Carrotron. I mean, maybe he just won't get another Astro Shroom after we do this. Uh, are we worried more about our face or what? Is this dying okay? Looks like this. I think we need this lane to stay clogged for another turn here. Here comes the beans. Pretty sure this is better at this point. Here comes the beans. If he doesn't have another Astro, we could still win this game. He's got tough beats from reincarnation, okay? Oh, we have Evaporate for that, so that worked out well. It also activates Stomping on, that's pretty cool. Don't drop that coconut. Hey, don't drop that Just evaporate, I guess. Bird of Paradise. Could we get lane two, please? He should have blown first. That's not a good play. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that's pretty good. He activates both. There you are. There's our gladiator. This is, game is actually winnable. Good shot from the tank now. He didn't get the proc our block. Oh, this game's actually winnable now. Because we got this. The superpowers is coming in. Rawr. So here's another one. Galvanize, Galvanize. Here we go, and and Con Man. We actually have two really strong counters to 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 cycle cap in this deck. We just the other last game we didn't get it, and this game we didn't get it. Now we finally have them. He can't cycle cap us. He loses. He loses to that. We're probably just going viral here. He's moving in, and he doesn't like the stomp it on. Yeah, we win that trade with going viral. Oh, this is easy. I'm so happy we finally beat this goddamn deck. This goddamn deck. This is definitely in the play, right? There's no question. It makes every lane go face, and it makes us win trades also now in every lane. Roar, and a Dino Roar. So here's five and four. Now he doesn't even get a chance to... <laughs> he, could, he could get a Punish Room to face here. Yay, it didn't matter. Whoa! Was that a glitch? The, the, the board usually like zooms in on him. The board just exploded. I have never seen that in s seven years of playing this game. I've never seen. Am I tripping or is that not happen every single time? Am I just losing my mind or was that a glitch? I have to rewatch that. But yeah, we're eight and three guys. Great stream. A am I am I losing my mind? Was I just looking in the wrong spot? 
I have to watch that again. The, the board, the zoom happened way too fast there, right, guys? A am I tripping or what? The chat's still catching up to my... With the delay, we have a little kind of a minute delay here now. That wasn't... It wasn't lag. It happened in my blue stacks. It happened in the app. Let me watch it again. Oh, no, that is not. <laughs> the zoom just happened too fast. It usually like zooms in gradually. What an explosive ending to the stream. What the hell was that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so cool. Uh, that was a glitch. It was a glitch, guys. It was a glitch. I, is there a way for me to quickly... Someone clip it. If you can clip it real quick, then you can watch the clip. Yeah, someone clipped five it. And four guys, and type it. Doesn't even get... Look on this... T click on this clip over here that Super did if you want to see it real quick. No, it definitely zoomed way too fast. It does not do that. It just zooms in slowly. I'm gonna go and check a past game to make sure I'm not completely tripping here. It never does that. It never does that. It never does that. Here. No, it, it zooms slowly. I'm just watching one of the last games that we won just now. <laughs> it just zooms so fast. Guys, there's a there's a clip here someone did. Is that a glitch? Type so click on that, you'll see it. Alright, anyway. <laughs> a lot of excitement. This deck was so fun. This was so good. It played really effectively. We lost to, you know, Cycle Cap, we split games, even though we have good answers money. to that. Just saying, but if you beat the daily we can make a card out of it. Conjure nine wins. The plant hero conjures three wins. I don't wins. know what you're talking about, the daily. But, um... You know, the early game did well. The Stompin' On and the, you know, the Stompin' On and Tankless Service both did well. Unexpected Gifts was great. This was a really fun deck. It's definitely going on YouTube. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. This is Fry.